Hey everyone, it's Stephanie with Move by Purpose. Today I want to talk to you about how you are wired and how to use this knowledge to really determine what a really great career fit would be for you. There have been four distinct personality characteristics um, that have been identified throughout history. And the profile that I use and the tool that I use with every client is the DISC personality profile. And I will break down what each letter stands for. The D stands for dominant. Um, this person is very driven, very decisive, very, very direct. Um, they can be perceived as very uh, bossy and hence the word it stands for is dominant or domineering. Um, very aggressive, very fast-paced personality. They have a tendency to lose their temper quickly. They're also very um, hot-headed, but on the upside, they're excellent in a crisis situation. They're um, excellent leaders. They know how to delegate and they are go-getters. They're motivated by success and achievement. They're more results-oriented than people-oriented. The I stands for influencing or inspiring, interested in people. They are typically the life of the party, usually very uh, bubbly people. They are very, very social. They talk a lot. They know how to keep the conversation going. They're very lively. They tend to wear very fashionable clothes, um, very bold, bright patterns and colors. Uh, typically, even in the winter, the higher the eye is or the, um, the more um, expressive they're going to be using their hands and the more uh, loud their voice is going to be. And the I and the D are a lot easier to pinpoint and spot out uh, because of their more outgoing and extroverted nature. Next is the S. And S is the silent majority. About 69% of people um, fall into this category. And S is just such a sweet personality. They're excellent supporters. They stand for stable or steady, secure. They love their security. Their greatest fear is change. Um, they have no problem letting other people make the decisions. In fact, they prefer other people to make the decisions. They might have a little bit of a difficult time with the D personality if they feel uh, pushed or pressured because they're very slow paced people. They need a lot of reassurance and they just kind of go with the flow, the status quo. They don't like making ripples, um, but they're very, very people oriented. They're excellent, excellent listeners. And they're just so sweet to have around. And they tend to be the glue of any type of family, working relationship or friendships. Um, they get along with pretty much every personality provided that you're not you know, too bossy and too pushy for them. C stands for compliant, um, correctness, conscientious. This personality really, really likes their facts and their data. They want accuracy. They want precision. They need a ton of information before proceeding with any action. And a lot of times our biggest downfall is that if risk is perceived at all or if anything could go wrong because of them being more perfectionists in nature, they won't act. So they have a tendency to do ready, aim, 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 and never pull the trigger. Whereas a D will more do ready, fire, aim, and they can shoot themselves in the foot or hurt somebody else because of their lack of planning and lack of slowing down. Um, Cs do have a tendency to get highly irritated with I personalities, um, but they actually partner very, very well with eyes because they slow an eye down and really help them to see things that an eye doesn't typically take the time to look into or think of. 
Um, because eyes are just very just de- they're also very decisive. They also just like, oh, that looks fun, let's do that, and they commit right away, um, without really thinking through all of the possible outcomes or potential problems that may arise. Um, and they can t- tend to jump the gun as well. So S's and C's are introverts, they're quieter, they're more reserved. Um, and a C is more results oriented than people oriented and they work really really well independently and if you I will give you a link in the show notes to um, more information on the disc there's tons of combinations there's actually 25 personality style combinations with the disc I was giving you the very very basics and I will give that link at the bottom of the this video and also provide a link to where you can buy your own profile. I highly, highly recommend you purchasing your own and really getting clear on where exactly you are. This tool will have a career match too with ideas of where your strengths are, how to communicate with uh, your relationships in your life and where a good fit will be and it's just great knowledge to have it's very great insight for you and really can be a guiding tool with where your next steps are in your life 